Hello friend and welcome back to my channel or Patreon depending on where you're watching this video. If it's a Patreon then you are first to see the video as always. In the previous episode, Shiel and Sebastian disguised as Master Michaelis have set the purple house on fire. And since they are acting on Queen's orders, they can do whatever they want. Besides, who would have known that it's the devil himself that has set the mansion on fire? Acting as a young lord's butler on Queen's Victoria's orders. Truly hilarious and I absolutely love it. Now I wonder whether we will see the Derek, Quinn's relative, as his last whereabouts is known to be a purple house and will she be finally able to attend the midnight tea party? I don't know, but let's find out. And as always, don't forget to like and subscribe to help this channel grow. Thanks. Ooh. Yeah, the whole mansion is on fire. Yeah, why are they all just holed up in the... Yes, my lord. <laughs> I love every time I hear it. So, what is he going to do? There's no way he is inside. What is it? So does it mean that Derek is dead? Mm -hmm. Is that what you think? What if he's just buried somewhere <laughs> behind the skull? <laughs> Don't know, but I'm very curious to find that out. Oh, interesting. Clearly, if Derek is not there and they've told him Derek is there, terrible lie. Now he's put in the fire. <laughs> of course, I mean, I understand. Is that really what she should be worried about? A competition? Oh, <laughs> Sebastian! <laughs> I can't believe you're right in the elephant. <gasps> I mean, I wouldn't expect anything less than that. <laughs> oh, kid, calm down and put your pride in the pocket for once. Princess Soma, well said! That's right! <laughs> Her house is like this. Dark and scary and... It's not even a tsundere. I don't know what it is. Proper bad. Sebastian's so suspicious. I love his look. There's a problem. <sighs> too early and that would be too suspicious. First thing in the morning, thinking about elimination of another druid. <laughs> it's so shell like. <laughs> so evil. <laughs> yeah, because they are nerds, right? So anything physical, they might struggle to win. Oh. If the headmaster is coming, then will that mean that Shia will get involved? Mm -hmm. If you're thinking what I'm thinking, definitely. <laughs> oh. Okay. Worthy of a gentleman. I mean, that's a little bit suspicious. And who was the chosen one last year? Don't tell me it was Derek and he disappeared. Oh, that's not good. I mean, maybe it's good actually. What does he want? Well, that's suspicious. Just like how? I'm so confused. Hmm. 
Yes, and obviously Shio is the best for strategy. Evil ones. Sponsor? Oh, but of course it's Sebastian. Why didn't I think of that? <laughs> well done. <laughs> Look at his happy smile. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yeah, you have to pretend to be a happy boy. Oh, look at him clinging to Michaelis. I bet he's like, proper like, don't you laugh at me. <laughs> Perfect acting skills, like, no one would think he's faking it. Mm hmm. <laughs> uh. <laughs> Can't help but love it. <laughs> Look at these fake styles. <laughs> oh, love it. <laughs> Perfect. I knew it. <laughs> But of course, any means necessary. Gosh, I sound like a real villainess. It must be the look. <laughs> Sorry, guys. It's just like that. Sometimes I slip. Oh, it's the vis uh, vice headmaster. The one that always falls and bleeds. I wouldn't be surprised if he does it again. <gasps> Elizabeth! <laughs> That's got to be the strong athletes from the greenhouse. And there we go. Whoa, okay, I mean, it looks really cool. I'd love to wear the armor. <laughs> Although it's really, 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 really heavy, trust me. Uh-huh. <laughs> Scarlet. Really not my cup of tea. <laughs> Purple hairs. Dark. Scary. <laughs> Girls, right. <laughs> I love how those normies are just terrified of them. <laughs> I bet they're not even really that bad. And it's time for the shield's house. How is it gonna look like? Something formal and serious, I guess. Oh, golden blue. Beautiful. The shell holding a head wig. <laughs> <laughs> oh, bless. <laughs> oh, Elizabeth. Oh my god, you are so embarrassing him. <laughs> Love it though. <laughs> that looks like a goblet from Harry Potter. Goblet of fire. <laughs> a rainbow. <laughs> Couple of rainbow. Mm, looking forward to that. It's a nice fire. I suppose. <laughs> I knew it. I just knew he's gonna fall. <laughs> there is no episode without him falling, right? So many nobles. And obviously they're all gathered around Redmond. Oh, is that a chocolate school? <laughs> is that school covered with like a chocolate fountain? Are you for reals? Let them enjoy the ball. 
Let's go to be his sisters! Oh, wow. Oh my god, you are so embarrassing him. They can have everyone else! <laughs> oh my god. Oh. They do indeed. I must love him so much after all, he's the only man in the family. I mean, he's the only manly sibling. No, don't tell me. Don't tell me one of them is to be married and... Please, he's got Elizabeth. And besides, Elizabeth is a total badass. He doesn't need a meek lady. Shielu, <gasps> you are in trouble! <laughs> oi, 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 calm down, you're supposed to protect and support him. Well, duh. <laughs> Ah, <laughs> uh, you qualified then. Nice. I mean, kind of obvious since he has a royalty. Money always wins, right? I didn't know that cricket came from India. There's always something to learn, right? Oh no, I recognize his voice. Great. Please. Go! Oh, poor Shell. Oh, kind. I'm sorry, guys. I don't like him. Oh, I help you. <laughs> I totally agree with you. <laughs> Indecent <laughs> butler. <laughs> Totally. <laughs> yeah, you better support and behave, woman. <laughs> Don't tell me, Elizabeth, you nearly slipped. Like, how old are you? I guess you are giving them a little bit too much credit. As much as I love Lizzie, her voice actress does a very annoying job. But she has to use this voice to pretend to be weak and meek. It's a shame. I hope that one day she'll be able to shine. Oh, they really win. So there's a chance for Blue House. Like Brother like son. Mm. Okay, memory from the past then. Who could it be though? Wait, don't tell me. Could it be Shiel's father? That he was in that house. I mean, after all, he's a proper... He was a proper mastermind. A queen's dog. So... Could it be that he also was in the mission? Is he right? 
Vincent of Phantom Hive. Big eyebrows. This is not exactly how I have imagined Vincent Phantom Hive to be, because I'm pretty sure we saw him in a family photo or family painting and his face was a bit longer. But maybe that's because he is a kind of teenager there and I think they make faces longer in this anime the older you are. Mm -hmm. I think that is the case. Nevertheless, we have learned something really important. Derek wasn't in the purple house and the whole P4 is hiding it from everyone else. None of the boys that were missing are there. So where are the transferees? And why does the headmaster behave so weirdly, choosing somebody on his whim, somebody that will be able to go to the meeting with him if they win the cricket or behave in a gentlemanly way? Now, I'm really curious about that. But how Ball was a little bit hilarious, like with so many funny characters. I love that Lizzie was there. It was so good to see her. I really miss her from the Book of Atlantic. And I really want to see show in action. But I guess the cricket tournament will take place in the week of time, or at least I hope so. So, because knowing Sebastian and Shell, they are going to come up with a hilarious plan, the masterpiece to soften Headmaster's heart and create a drama that they will just play as the best actors in the whole school. I cannot imagine what that's going to be, but I'm sure as hell it will be epic. So stay tuned and see you in the next episode. A Bye. massive thank you for everyone supporting me on this YouTube journey. And big thank you to my patrons, particularly Isaac and the rest of you, always liking, commenting, supporting me on Patreon as well as on the YouTube channel. Big thank you to the members of my YouTube channel. It's great to have you here. And honestly, you guys, and also you, who is always commenting, liking, Liking under my videos. Thank you so much because that really tells me that you like my reactions and it really motivates me to do more and work harder for you guys and getting better at it. For those of you who doesn't know, I do have a Patreon. You can find there over 150 videos in uncut, full length and 100% opacity early released, which means that we are far ahead with every single episode on my Patreon and there as well you can find some Patreon exclusive videos which you won't find on my YouTube channel and you can even get a shout out in my video so I truly encourage you to join my Patreon and discover the rest of the perks or simply join my YouTube community where you'll get a special badge prior to replying to comments and access to special budget. All the funds that I raise from Patreon and YouTube goes towards my subscriptions for video editing programs, cosplay or just dressing up in general and everything else involved with video making. Please stay with me as we are going to get better. Thanks so much everyone and see you in the next episode. Bye!